Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a July favourites where I show you all of my favourites from July. Although to be fair, quite a lot of these are from are just my favourites in general and I just I've loved them for like such a long time now and I just wanted to, to share them with you really. But yes, I just want to start by saying I apologise um if you hear me sniffing throughout the video. I I know it's really gross and I will try and edit a lot of them out. Um yes, I've got a bit of a cold. Um, despite it being summer, but that's just, it's just me for you. I've got around uh, 13 things that I like to show you <laughs> today. I think it's 13 anyway, it probably doesn't really matter anyway. Um, but yes, without further ado, let's get started. So I'm going to start with my first thing. Uh, this is the Tangle Teaser. Um, this is the limited edition colour. I... It's my first Tangle Teaser and I don't know why it's my first, like they've been around for such a long time now and I don't know why it's my first to be quite honest. Um, I bought this yesterday, I bought this yesterday and I can say that I used, to, that I used it this morning and honestly it's the best thing that has happened since sliced bread. Uh, my usual brush, oh I put it back in the box by the way just to make it look pretty, um, but yeah um, my usual brush like kills my hair because my hair is so long um and it just really really hurts to just brush to brush it and then today literally I brushed my hair it didn't hurt one bit um and I I feel like it's a lot better on the hair anyway just because I mean it says it's better on the hair anyway so that's probably why I feel it but yeah that is the first thing uh, and I thought the pink and the yellow go together really well so just really loved that so yeah Although I am pretty annoyed because I when buying it yesterday I bought it from John Lewis and um it said that it was only ten pound ninety, it was like cheaper than the rest for some reason. And I got to the till and the lady charged me eleven pounds and I was I didn't notice until this morning to be honest, so oh well. I mean it was only twenty P more no. Oh my god, how embarrassing. It was only ten P more than I thought, but still, like it's ten P but I'm worse off. <laughs> the next thing that I have been that I have been loving for quite a while now, well actually quite recently I've quite enjoyed it. Um it is the Origins face mask and face mask primer. Um I went in quite a while ago into House of Fraser and I bought this. Um let me just show you what I got. So I got the Origins Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask to Clear Pores, which it has honestly been doing perfectly but I'll just get into that in a second um, and then I also bought the um, maskimizer that you like spray on your face before you apply the mask um, sorry um, yeah I bought I bought these together because it worked out that you got them like quite a lot cheaper than if you were to buy them by themselves if you get me um, yeah that makes sense so yeah, I bought them together and basically I tried them quite a while ago and then I, I don't really like see a difference. Uh, maybe because I didn't have that many pores back then and it probably wasn't as stressed as I am now. But I'm not going to get into that. Anyway, I recently used these. It was quite recently as well and I really, really, really noticed a difference. Like I usually get a lot of pores like on my nose and... I don't really know where else really. But yeah, I really found that my nose was so much softer after I'd used this. I'm not really too sure if this has made a difference because I've never tried this mask without it. But I assume that it helps with the mask. I mean, it doesn't actually say that it... It just says that it's supposed to, like, mask... Maximise the mask... Mask's effect. That is so hard to say. But yeah. I really do love these together. They were a bit on the pricey side, as you probably already knew, but um, I'm glad that I paid that amount of money for them because they genuinely do work. The next thing is also a product that I've... Well, it's, it's a product that I've bought recently. I don't know why I said also. Oh, yeah, because I said the um, the Tangle Teaser was a product I bought um, recently. Anyway, um, I bought the Milkshake Leave-In Conditioner. Um, oh, my legs are hurting a bit. I might just have to move the camera down so I can sit. Because I'm currently sat on my knees. I just want to like sit cross-legged so that I'm, my knees, my legs won't die. <laughs> yeah, give me one sec. 
Okay, I'm back. <laughs> a little bit lower down this time. But yeah, as I was saying, um, I bought the milkshake leave-in conditioner. This stuff smells so freaking good. Um, and it wasn't too expensive either. I think this was like n uh, nine pounds. No, eight eight pounds, which I thought was really good. And um, I used it this morning. Um, I, at the moment, I can't really like smell anything because obviously my nose is so blocked up. Um, but I just know this. It does smell really good. It smells just like a milkshake, and I am obsessed with it. Not too sure if it's like if it's like made any difference to my hair yet because obviously this is only the first day that I've used it. But I'm really hoping it's gonna be, it's gonna live up to it. Yeah, I, I'm really hoping it's gonna work. But um, I don't really care if it doesn't work because it obviously smells so good anyway. So yeah, that is that. Oh, I bought my friend a little one as well. It's so much tinier compared to this. <laughs> but I wasn't sure if she wanted the leave-in conditioner, so I just bought her a little one, and then I can easily get her a big one like mine. But yes. That is that. So then the next thing is, um, oh, I'm going to have to be careful, like, because I've got them on the floor laid out and I don't want to mix up the ones I've already shown you because otherwise I'll be showing you them again. Um, yes, yes. So I recently bought, um, well, I've been using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation for quite a while now and I really do really like it. <laughs> I've got it on today. don't know if my skin looks absolutely flawless or not. But yeah, and then um, I purchased the Perfecting Loose Powder from Estee Lauder as well. Um, it, oh, I think this is just in the shade Translucent. And it's really, like, made my skin, like, really soft. And it set my foundation so much better than my usual one. Because I, my usual powder was just, like, a cheap one from uh, Superdrug. I don't know. I think it was Maybelline one. But yeah, I, I really loved these two together at the moment. So just thought I'd include them in my July favourites. The next thing is my... Where's my phone? Oh. Oh, I'll sat on it. <laughs> Basically, I got a new phone. I got the iPhone 6S Plus in rose gold. It's absolutely huge. But when I compare it to my old phone... I don't know where my old phone is. My old phone is absolutely tiny now. And it's I just don't know how I, I got on so long with such a tiny phone. Like, just this phone is absolutely perfect. Like, oh, I love it. And yes, the thing I was going to show you is the phone case. Um, I bought two phone cases, but I'll get into the other one in a second. But this phone case I am obsessed with. It's got ice creams on it and it's got a little bit of glitter on it and it matches the colour of my actual phone itself. This is from Skinny Dip. I bought this from... Uh, I bought this from the Topshop website. It did take a really long time to come. It took... It, it was supposed to come on a Tuesday but it came on the Thursday and I ordered it online um, to go into the store and I had to go in and collect it and yeah it took it took far too long so I'm never gonna do that again to be honest but yeah um oh they have so many cute products that like match this pattern they've got a rucksack and they've got a makeup bag and I just want to get them all but I don't know I don't know if I'm going to just because like I don't really wear rucksacks and I have way too many makeup bags at the moment so yeah that is that I just I'm obsessed with it and I love it because it goes in with the theme of summer at the moment even though it's not really that summery where I live <laughs> this is like a little marble effect I'll show you an up close version of it but um yeah and what it looks like on my phone but I really really do love it it's so nice I'm really into like marble at the moment uh and just like stone effect in general really I just I love it so yeah that was from Pullin' Bear. Uh, the next thing, um, this is like quite something that I've had for quite a long time now. Um, it's my MAC eyelash curlers. I said this before in one of my favourite videos, but um, I just cannot live without, without, um, what are they called? What are they called? Eyelash curlers. I cannot live without these, and they're MAC. Um, I don't really think that like branded like um uh, must uh these <laughs> I keep forgetting their name. I don't think that branded these are any different to the cheapest ones you can get, but I just I just love these really. I, I just love these in general. Yeah. <laughs> Not really else I can say about that, but yeah, that's that. Uh we're slowly getting there, so I'm going to split it up now and I'm going to go on to a piece of clothing that I recently bought. I bought this. Hold on. I bought this. It's a little bralette and it is absolutely adorable. Uh, it's also from Topshop. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, my camera just stopped recording, so I'm really sorry about that. I mean, you probably won't even notice, to be honest. Um, <clears throat> anyway, as I was saying, actually, I can't remember what I was even talking about. Oh, I was talking about the bralette, right. So, yes, the bralette, it's sort of got, like, a harness at the back, and um, it, like, opens up at the front, and it's just got such pretty detailing, and it's, like, absolutely gorgeous. I really, really, really love it. There is one tiny thing that I'm really annoyed about, but um, I think my mum will be able to fix it. But it's sort of like fraying here. Let me just show you over my black top. It's frayed on the like a strap that goes like there. Yeah, there. Yeah, it just looks so cute, and I have been looking for a bralette for such a long time that I finally bought one. So yeah, that is that. The next thing is also something that I've been loving for such a long time now, and it's the Garnier Micellia Water. I think I pronounced Micellia right. Um, if not, then I don't know how to say it. But this removes makeup, it cleanses, and it soothes. Oh, it's so good. It really is good. I usually have two cotton pads, and I like cover it, cover them in this, and then I just like use that use one for one side of my face and then I use the other for the other and it really does remove all your makeup it's really good I really recommend it honestly I just think it's great and it doesn't even sting your eyes and it doesn't taste weird if you put it over your mouth um, it's just all round perfect really I love it the next thing is something that I have been wanting for a while but I always thought they were far too pricey to buy, um, and that is the MAC lipsticks. Yeah, I thought that was upside down then, but yeah, my sister bought me this very kindly as a little present, and um, I bought it, I asked for the shade Whirl. Um, this colour's kind of, I'd say it's like a nice little shade of like, uh, I just squashed the box. It's a nice little shade of like um, a brownie, like, here you go I'll just let you see because I'm not really good at describing colours um, but it looks like that and I have been wearing it quite a lot since I got it and it stays on my mouth for so long it is amazing I'm 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 definitely probably gonna <laughs> definitely probably I'm definitely gonna start buying more lipsticks from there because it is totally worth the money and yeah they just do some really good colour so yeah that is I've been really loving that um, another makeup product is the, it's an eyeshadow and I got this from Sainsbury's. I think it's a Sainsbury's own brand because it says on the back, produced in China for Sainsbury's. Um, and it wasn't very pricey at all, it's, it goes by the name Boutique, so it sort of like looks like that. I don't know if you can see, is it focusing? Just me in the background. Oh, let's focus on me. God's sake. <laughs> that is really funny. Is it focused? Oh, okay. Well, it looks like that. And it's a really pretty, like, shimmery rose gold colour. Um, and it, it, it blends really well. Uh, oh, I just, I don't really know what to say about it, apart from the fact that it's really good and it blends well. And it's quite pigmented as well, like, believe it or not. I just think that's, they're probably going to be really successful, I reckon. Um, as a brand, uh, as a as like a, a high street brand. Uh, the next thing, oh, I've got two things left. The next thing is a lip balm by Benefit, and it's the um, I don't know how to say it, but it's, it's, it's sort of spelt like that. I don't know if you can see it. There you go. Oh, that focus well. It's spelt like that. So I think it's like Bien Bien Balm. Um, and I've got it on today, it may have come up a bit, let me check my mirror. But yeah, I think it's a really nice natural colour and it's like, it's just like a, a lip balm and it just m keeps your lips moist <laughs> and stuff like that and it's just so nice. I love it. I've only recently just got into it. I had it for Christmas with like a pinkier one and then I also had some like, um, some like cheek and lip stains with it as well and like a little set. Um, and yeah, I've just recently got into it, which is fantastic. Who doesn't... Who loves... Yeah. Um, the last thing that I am going to be talking to you about is these makeup brushes. These 
are so fabulous. I have been wanting makeup brushes like this for such a long time now. They are eyeshadow brushes, in case you didn't know. And they are by NYX. Um, I bought the number 16 one and I bought number 17 one and my favourite out of them both is number 16 because I feel like it blends way much better than this although this one here still does the trick but I just prefer this one because it's like I feel like it's a little bit softer and then this one here is a little more dense so it's a bit harder but they're still both really really soft I just I use it today to apply my eyeshadow and I use it every day really and then I like like to blend it out properly with this one um, but they're both so good and I'm so glad I, I bought them um, I'm definitely going to be going and getting more products from NYX because they're like not too expensive and they are such a good brand really. okay so that is everything for today I really hope you enjoyed the video um, leave a like and a comment do whatever you want uh, have a good day and I'll see you in my next video Bye.